Hey guys, my name is Damon Reed. I'm a captain with the Conway Fire Department and we're here doing the final inspection on a new truck five for us. This aerial platform is replacing a 1998 model, uh, Pierce as well, and we've just used it so much that it's worn out. Uh, one thing that we have changed with this new aerial is the velocity cab. Uh, this will be the second velocity cab that we've got and everybody uh, on the truck one really likes the cab. And so uh, we're liking the extra room in it. A lot of room in there. You know, they, they decided to go with four seats. Uh, typically we were in with uh, three per per ladder. And so there was no need to have the extra seats. So now we got more space to uh, uh, secure our helmets and, and turnout gear. Of course, we run with the pump on our ladders because it's possible if the engine's out that this could be first due and have to pump at a working fire. And um, we're not just a real big city, seven fire stations, so it's also possible that this thing might have to catch its own hydrant. And so we really like the capability to be able to pump with our aerials. We, we added the uh, foam system, the Husky, on this aerial so that we could have essentially a standpipe system out of the bucket with foam, and uh, specifically for our, our helipads on top of the hospitals just in case anything was to ever happen up there, uh, we could get some foam up there uh, to the top of the hospital. A couple things we changed in our compartment space is the pull-out drawers. And we get things out here and pick it up much easier uh, as opposed to having to bend over to get it out. And everybody seems to be liking that on the job. And then I want to point out the rope lighting. We have really liked the upgrade to the rope lighting in all the compartments. It seems to light up better, and uh, we're not changing out light bulbs all the time inside the compartments. One thing I really like about this ladder truck, or the complimented ladders, is we've got a 28-foot ladder instead of a 24. And we run a lot of dormitories in the city of Conway um, that are three or four stories. And so that extra few feet of ladder really helps. And of course, we've got the 35, but if we've got a bunch of rescues to perform on a third floor, then the 28 really comes in handy on that. All right, we've got the remote control for the uh, operator to set up the aerial, and that's a little bit different. So now it's a one person job as opposed to running back and forth to get each the, the driver and the officer side set up. So I think this will be a good improvement for our personnel on this ladder truck. Something we're looking forward to on this ladder truck as opposed to our 98 model that this one's replacing is we've got the blue rope lighting uh, that runs the length of the ladder. And so we can kind of see from a command perspective, it, it gives us a reference to see how high the ladder is with that continuous rope lighting up there. And so that seems to be a really good feature. We like the uh, cord reel here, 200 feet long. So uh, we're actually moving away from generators on our engine companies and so uh, the cord reel is going to come in more and more convenient at, as we're at a working fire. And again, we've got the cross lace because this apparatus does have the possibility, if the engine's out on another call or, or training, for this to be first due at a working fire. And so they've got the inch and three quarter cross lays. We still do the traditional gold leaf uh, on our City of Conway Fire Rescue and, and the apparatus name and number. And that's something that we're doing, spending a couple extra dollars on just for traditional purposes. Uh, all our old timers, they had it on their fire trucks, so we're continuing that tradition with, with us. Now something we're doing to all our new apparatus is putting the sidebar lights on, so we're just more visible, especially as we're pulling out of the fire station. Some of our stations are on pretty busy streets, and uh, so anything that we can do to make our job safer as far as the, the citizens seeing us as we're responding down the road, and that seems to be a really good upgrade for us. I hope you've enjoyed looking over our new Truck 5. We're really looking forward to getting it into our city and putting it in service and putting this thing to work.